today in this uh, tutorial video I want to show you how to export a DXF file from AutoCAD to Orion so <clears throat> for example we have here on the screen in the AutoCAD environment the ground floor plan of a a one bedroom flat apartment uh, and the first floor plan uh, as was received from my architect but before I continue I would encourage each and every one of us to please like this video and uh, do well to subscribe to my youtube channel at Nemi consult so right away these are the two um, modeling uh, received from my architect and I went on to um, uh, model the beam and the column general arrangement showing the column positions and the arrangement of the beams so I will have to um, create a new uh, uh, a new AutoCAD environment uh, and um, uh, copy this floor plan, the V beam and column general arrangement into the new environment and then save as a DXF file. Remember, Orion does not read DWG files, rather, it reads DXF files. So we go ahead to copy this floor plan. Say copy. Now you go to file go to new so you you create a new page where you now have to um, paste the copied floor plan here it is it has been copied and pasted here we don't need this uh, identification so we delete it so next is to save this plan as a DXF file so you go to file you go to save as now down here you have the file name let's call it tutorial one now file of type you open the box there you will see different uh, versions you have 2004 2007 i am using autocad 2007 for this project so <clears throat> for some of you who might be using higher versions of autocad here you can find those versions and the lower ones as well so i want to save this file as a dxf file so i can see autocad 2007 dxf file so you click on it and then you save now we are almost done with what we have so you now close you you close this okay so now you Having closed it, you can now go and open your Orion 18. So this is Orion 18 being opened. Let's wait a minute. Um, it's loading. Orion is a very um, useful tool which you know you can use to model and analyze reinforced concrete structures it gives you accurate results uh, provided you you imputed uh, you you carried out correct loading on the structure you will at the end of the day get um, very correct uh, output uh, result so um, the Orion 18 environment has loaded here we have by default a project that came with the software so we have to now create a new project so click on new project let us save 
our work as um, let's save our work as uh, uh, flats let's save it as flats then you click on ok here um, on the setting center we have different um, um, codes that are available we have the Hong Kong COP uh, we have Island Euro code uh, but we are only interested in using BS8110 UK some other person might decide to use um, Euro code uh, UK uh, but here in Nigeria mostly um, we either use BS8110 UK or uh, Euro code but for this project I will be making use of um, UK BS8110 and the next is to click on import and the sheet that shows you the sheet size that I will be employing for this project so um, we have different uh, sheet sizes we have A4 we have A3 um, but for me I normally use A0 because it uh, it contains uh, uh, it, it has enough space to contain whatever drawing I want to uh, make so you click on A0 then you click on OK we are good to go so the environment is loading it will show us the environment where we can do our work okay it has been completed so on the Orion environment as you can see the sheet has no content so we have to now um, import the DXF file so that we and continue with the you know the modeling properly so now you have to go to file you scroll down to model file import just having your cursor there the this dialog box appears so you now search for external reference drawing you know the DXF file from AutoCAD is an external file you are trying to import it from AutoCAD to Orion so you click on external reference drawing now it asks you a question project should be saved before this process do you want to save the project uh, the answer is yes so we save the project now on the load uh, tab you you can load the you can load in the, the drawing so clicking on this load um, tab I will search for the DXF file which I already saved from AutoCAD um, remember I saved it as tutorial 1 um, let me be sure that it is this one because um, I don't know um, okay okay so let us uh, load it in so it is this one tutorial one so you click on open now I did the drawing in AutoCAD and uh, the unit I used was uh, meters so in order to import this drawing I should employ the same unit so that it can enter into my uh, uh, my my, uh, my sheet so you tick on meters and then you click OK now as you can see the drawing has has been shown on the screen but it is not uh, coming out clear enough so you click on use DXF colors now you can see the drawing has shown clearly so you click on close here we have our drawing yeah here we have our drawing on the Rurion environment um, that is all with this video tutorial and next we shall be um, performing uh, modeling analysis and design of these uh, projects thank you very much for watching um, uh, do well to like this video and also subscribe to my youtube channel Thank you and, um, and God bless.